Hi everyone, my name is Emma and today we're going to be doing a seated stretch class. This class will be a super quick one and it will be fantastic if you've just finished a workout or you just feel like you need a nice little stretch out and can't be bothered standing and can't be bothered lying down. <laughs> All right guys, without further ado, let's get started. Let's come down onto the mat. So just getting nice and comfortable here, relaxing those shoulders down. We're going to bring our left hand down onto the mat. So inhale, lift that right arm up towards the sky and exhale, get that nice side body stretch here. Inhale and exhale, come back to center. Let's take it to the other side. Inhale and exhale. Beautiful work, coming back to center, taking it over to the other side. Beautiful, this time maybe look up towards the ceiling here. So you're just really opening up into the chest. Relax that shoulder down and coming back to center. Beautiful, taking it onto the other side. Stretching over, try and keep both sit bones planted down onto the mat here. Good, and just opening up here. Looking up towards the ceiling. And coming back to center, beautiful work. This time we are going to take our right hand to our left knee <laughs> and our left hand to our right knee. Beautiful work. We are just going to tuck our chin under and curve through that spine, getting that beautiful, nice neck stretch here. I'm going to stretch through our trapezius muscles as well, making sure that those shoulders are nice and relaxed. Beautiful work. And coming back to centre, let's swap our hands over. Inhale, look up. Exhale, fold forward. Good. So getting a nice curve through that back here, relax those shoulders down. And just really grabbing onto those knees to give you some stability here. And exhale, coming back to center. Beautiful work, this time taking our right hand to our right knee and left hand to our left knee. Good, we inhale, we look up, bring the chest forward. So this is like cat cow seated. So we inhale, bring the chest forward, look up towards the ceiling and exhale, we grab onto those knees and round through the spine, chin to chest. Beautiful, inhale, look up. And exhale, round the spine, chin to chest. Beautiful work. One more time. Inhale, look up. And exhale, we round through, chin to chest. Good work. Coming back to centre here. This time, we are going to take our right knee or right leg over the top of that left leg. We're going to bring our left arm up towards the sky, grab onto that right leg, and exhale, we twist over to the side here. So you can really pull in that leg if you would like a deeper uh, glute stretch, or utilize this stretch as a nice spinal twist here, and look over towards your right shoulder. Looking towards the back of the room here. Beautiful work, guys. Coming back to centre. Now swinging yourself around and bringing your hands onto the mat. You're just going to bend through those elbows and just get that nice open, uh, twisty stretch here. It's almost like just like a counter stretch. Good, and coming back to center. Now, we are going to do one of my favorite stretches. So you can either bring your knee on your knee, so you've kind of crossed that top leg right over, or you can bring your shin on your shin, or you can bring that top leg, so that top leg is on top here, or you can bring that top leg in front, whatever you feel more comfortable with here. I'm gonna bring a knee on knee because I just love this stretch. And sitting up nice and tall, sitting up here, just grabbing onto those hands, relaxing those shoulders down and opening up that chest. You might find that this stretch is enough for you and that's totally fine. You just stay here and just enjoy this beautiful 
opening and stretch out through those uh, glutes here. Or if you'd like a little bit more, start to fold forward. And just relaxing that head down. Just breathing through it here. Staying where you are, I'll just show you the other stretches. So this is the right leg on the shin on shin one. Sitting up nice and tall, that's fine. You can stay here if that's enough for you or you can come down. Again, leg in front of other leg. <laughs> Sitting up nice and tall, that might be enough or just coming down. Beautiful. Breathing here. Nice work, everyone. And just slowly coming back up. Do you see that this time our right leg is, is it right leg? No, it's our left leg going over the top of our right leg this time. We're going to bring our right arm up towards the ceiling, grabbing onto that left leg and twisting round. Just be quite gentle here. So don't, you know, really twist yourself. So you're gonna hurt yourself. Just be nice and gentle with your body. And really pulling in that leg if you want that beautiful glute stretch here. Or sitting up nice and tall and just twisting through that nice spine. That nice spine. <laughs> Good, and just releasing here, taking those arms over towards the other side and coming down, bending through those elbows. Just getting that nice counter stretch, that open stretch in here. Good, and coming back to center. So coming back onto the knee on knee, or shin on shin, or leg in front of leg. <laughs> Sitting up nice and tall here. And then when you're ready, and if you'd like, you can start to come forward. So just choosing what you'd like to do here, guys. Just breathing, breathing. Just relaxing that head down. Drop those shoulders, make sure they're not up towards your ears. And when you're ready, just start to roll up. Nice and slowly, beautiful work. Okay, this time we are going to bring that left ankle over the top of that right knee here and just get that nice figure four stretch in. So those hands are facing behind you here, so the fingers are facing away from you. You're gonna press up and open up that chest here. So shoulders are away from those ears, your chest is nice and proud, and you're pushing that knee away. You should feel a really nice stretch through this left glutey area. <laughs> This is one of my favorite stretches. I love a figure four stretch. Nice and juicy. <laughs> Good guys, and just gently unraveling here and taking your right ankle over your left knee or just swapping over. If you haven't done left to right or right to left, doesn't matter. <laughs> as long as you do both sides. <laughs> Good guys, so again, just pressing into those hands, make sure that your chest is nice and proud, your shoulders are away from your ears, and you're just pressing that knee away. Make sure that that leg, that foot of the leg that's bent is nice and flexed. Well, both legs are bent, but <laughs> the one that's over the top of the knee, Make sure it's nice and flexed. <laughs> oh, just breathing here. 
Good guys, and then just releasing that leg down. Beautiful work, just bringing those feet in front of you again, press up into the chest and just rock your knees side to side, getting that nice windscreen wiper motion happening. Beautiful work. Okay, coming back up to seated. This time we're gonna bring the soles of our feet together. Sitting up nice and tall, do not worry about having your feet up really close to you. You can have them this far, this far, whatever you want. And whatever, wherever you feel the stretch. Don't worry about, you know, really forcing yourself into the stretches. It should be just a gentle progression. Gentle stretch, you don't want to strain yourself. <laughs> so again, sitting up nice and tall. You might be totally fine here, and that's great. Just let gravity do the work. If you'd like a little bit more, you can start to come down. You can drop those elbows to the floor, just grabbing onto your toes or your ankles here. And you can drop that head down. You can bring your hand on hand, <laughs> make little fists, and rela relax your head, forehead on your fists. Whatever you like, or you might want to bring your arms out nice and long here. Dropping that head down. Hopefully your feet don't smell too bad <laughs> if your head's down here. Because <laughs> our nose, my nose is pretty close, close to my toes. <laughs> Good guys, and just slowly coming back up. When you are ready, we are going to open up your legs into a wide V here. So again, just coming as far as you would like, as you feel most comfortable. And flexing those feet up towards the ceiling here. So nice and flexed, nice and active. And we are just going to start to roll back down again. So you might, again, you might be fine here. Just sit up nice and tall and enjoy that nice opening of the inner thigh. Or if you'd like a little bit more, start to walk yourself down. And you can come onto your elbows if you'd like. And if, again, if you would like even more, you can start to bring your forehead down. Just make sure that those feet are nice and active. So making sure they're nice and flexed and the toes are pointing up towards the ceiling. Try and make sure that you're pushing your bottom down onto the mat as well and not lifting up those hips. <laughs> Good, guys. So again, you can rest your forehead on your hands or if you're super duper duper flexy, you can bring your body down. Just breathing through the stretch. When I was younger, I um, used to do dancing and I used to be able to get my whole body flat on the, um, on the ground in this stretch. Can't do that anymore, but <laughs> one day I'll get back to that. <laughs> Good guys, and just rolling up here. Nice work, just bringing your right arm up towards the ceiling here and starting to stretch over. So bringing that opposite arm, so your left arm on your inner thigh here or your, the inner part of your calf. I like doing this because it helps you lift up and open up that chest. We're not aiming for getting really far here and just rolling over. We want to enjoy that beautiful side body stretch. So that might mean that you won't come as far and that's totally fine. We wanna really stretch out through this side body here. And then you can press that uh, left arm into your right calf, uh, right calf, but why would you do that? Your left calf to try and open up here. Just helps to open up that chest. Have I repeated myself like 10 times? Opening up, just open up. <laughs> Good guys, and coming back to centre, let's go to the other side. Breathing, breathing, 
always make sure that you keep up with your breath. Even when you're stretching, it helps you get further, stay in the stretch, and get further into the stretch as well. Good, and gently lifting back up to center. Beautiful work. This time, just bring your legs in slightly. Okay, maybe a little bit more than slightly. <laughs> we are going to bring that left sole of the foot into your inner thigh, into your right inner thigh here. Now, looking, bringing your hips towards your foot, your leg, so we're not um, opened out towards the left knee here. We're looking, our hips are facing towards the right. It was a lot harder to explain than <laughs> I thought it would be. It's really not that hard. Anyway, <laughs> let's lift those arms up towards the sky and exhale, start to fold over that front leg. Good, guys. So again, do not worry if you can't touch your toes. Just come as far as you can. Enjoy that stretch out. It's meant to be a relaxing stretch. You know, don't be hard on yourself. So awesome that you turned up on the mat today and carved out some time for yourself. It's really great. So give yourself a pat on the back and just enjoy these stretches. Just relax. Relax those shoulders down. And your knee, of course, can be bent. Good. And just slowly rolling back up. This time we are going to uh, bring your hips to the front this time. So your leg, your right leg is slightly out and your hips are towards the front. This time we're going to reach that left arm up and over. So get that side body stretching again towards that right leg. Then we're gonna do my favorite thing. You guys have probably done this a hundred times with me. <laughs> Bring that left hand behind your left glute. You're gonna press down in that palm, press down in that left uh, shin here, and then lift up, come into that beautiful wild thing posture here. And coming back down, and we're just gonna do that a couple of times. Just enjoy that flow, coming into that side body stretch. Then lift up, come into your Wild thing. And slowly coming down, coming over. And lifting up into your wild thing. <laughs> Ooh, beautiful. And coming back down, let's take it to the other side. So remember, first one, our hips are towards the front. So hips are towards your left leg. We inhale, lift those arms up towards the sky and exhale, bend over. I'm just stretching out here through that hamstring. Again, your knee can be bent. Relax those shoulders down. Hmm. My tummy just grumbled. <laughs> Breathing, breathing. Your foot can be flexed or pointed here, whatever you fancy. Good guys, and just rolling up here, beautiful. Again, we're not going straight into our thing, are we? We're coming into that side body stretch, so changing the orientation of those hips, bringing them forward. We come over, get that nice side body stretch in. Bring that right hand behind you, plant it down behind your right glute, not your left glute, and lift up into Wild Thing. Oh, beautiful work, coming back over, stretch. And coming back, lifting up. Oh, beautiful work, and one more time here. Stretch over, and coming back. Nice work, guys, coming back down. Beautiful, beautiful work today. 
Just coming back into a seated position, just roll those shoulders round one way and then the other way. No, that's, that's the other way. <laughs> I think, I didn't know what I was doing. Good guys, just give them a little shake out. Let's just do a quick little neck stretch and you're all done guys. So just tucking that chin to your chest and then gently looking up towards the ceiling here. And bringing it back down. And then looking up. Good, one more time. And looking up. Beautiful, coming back to centre. Let's look towards our right. Or your left. <laughs> whichever way you fancy. And then coming to the other side, just getting that beautiful stretch down here. Just relax those shoulders, relax, relax. And coming back to center and taking it to the other side. Beautiful, and over to the other side. One more time here. And over to the other side. Nice work guys, coming back to center, just drop that uh, right ear to your right shoulder. Just be really gentle here. If you'd like a little bit more, you can bring that left hand out by your side and just flex through that wrist, that hand rather. And if you'd like even more, you can just bring that arm back. Ooh. And you can even tuck that chin down, coming into like a diagonal position here. Good, just being really gentle, coming back to the side and then lifting your head back up. Let's take it to the other side. So left ear to your left shoulder. Again, that might be enough for you. Or you can bring your right arm out to the side. Just flex that hand. Again, if you'd like a little bit more, just bring that arm behind you. All right, so just bringing that left ear to your left shoulder. And just bringing your right arm out to the side, flex that hand. And then if you'd like a little bit more, just bringing that hand behind you a little bit and you can tuck that chin to your chest. Wonderful work guys, just bringing your left ear again to your left shoulder and lifting back up, just relaxing everything down. Beautiful work today everyone. Let's just lift those arms up towards the sky and exhale, bring your hands down to your heart center. Fabulous, fabulous work. I hope you enjoyed that nice little stretch out guys. Uh, I do love seated stretches, they're always fun and they're nice and easy and you can just go and get your stretches done. <laughs> All right, guys, enough of me talking. I hope you have a lovely day and I'll see you very soon. See you later.